Again, good morning everyone! Ah, ganda ng market last Friday. We're gonna be talking about that and just over the weekend, crypto boom. So this was the pullback we're waiting for. Just waiting for it over the weekend. Kaso nga lang, na-miss ko nung Saturday. Because Saturday, I had a seminar. The boom started there. So, um, pero the good thing was um, my favorite, my favorite um, crypto which is Ripple. I'll explain to you why later. Bakit si Ripple ang paborito ko. Um, anyways, um, we'll talk about that later. Uh, but Ripple did good uh, do a good bounce. And on, on our eToro copy trading, I opened um, uh, around... Um, um, I was that 25% of my port. And then it's already gaining. So at least nakabawi naman tayo for April. I mean, for me. Right here. So, and I'm planning... Uh, I'm doing my best para makabawi tayo for me. As much as possible, wala tayong red naman. So, so far, so good. I hope the the climb goes up. But we don't know for sure. So, no guarantees in the market. But we'll still do our best. But then again, we're gonna be talking about the crypto boom, about crypto currency today. And po. and some um, very good, you know, from some very good um, news from eToro about the competition. I'm gonna be sharing it to everyone. And po. Um... Yeah, so I'm gonna go to the comments ng mga tao. I'm gonna I'm gonna read about it. Um, a little request of my end. Why while we are not yet um discussing talaga, we're not yet in the heart of the discussion. Please share the video, po. Please share the video to your Facebook walls and to your um what do you call this uh trading groups if you have any um para naman po yung mga friends niyo mag ma, ma inspire mag start mag ano what do you call this um uh, invest. And at the same time, um, the newbies in your trading groups will know um, about this program that will help them in return. And, uh, right, so let me just um, go down. Let me just uh, quiet that down. And so, yun, Francis Fahal, Fahilan, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Good morning, then. Joey Tanael, good morning. Mark Cortez, morning, Sir Lloyd. And to your family to your family too um sa inyong family din lahat kayo Noel Minano good morning sir request for aba smc smph analysis all right so i'll write these down kumusta natin ang mga yan all right so ayan um ben moneda may buntag sir lord may buntag din um nga pala um <laughs> medyo kulang ako sa tulog ngayon so pagkagising ko ilamos lang and diretso na live <laughs> Kasi, and I want to congratulate a friend of mine, si Cherise, um, for attorney na ngayon. Um, we were celebrating her bar passing last night. So, medyo matagal kami nakatulog. So, attorney Ursal, congratulations. And Mike16, good morning, Sir Lloyd and Laika. Pitchkit-check po si GMA7, Meg and Webb. Right, so GMA7, Meg is giving me good signals. Kaso nga lang, hirap basahin ngayon while it's very volatile. and so, yun, um, I'll write that down, Mike. Um, ben Moneda, Sir Insights for IDC and ABBA. Please, IDC and ABBA. IDC is in my recommendations for today. Si ABBA, um, not really in my recommendations. Let me post my recommendations po para sa inyo. So, I'll write these down, si IDC and ABBA. So, ABBA, I think may nag-request na kay ABBA, di ba? Yun, andyan na si ABBA. Um, ben Moneda, Sir, I already read that. Gilbert Veles, good morning. Asan yun? Good morning, sir. What's the best entry point to a stock when trading intraday? I always follow that what you've taught us. No, ma- no matter what I do, stocks that I pick always fails to go up. Gilbert, that is because mahirap mag intraday ngayon. Wala pong gaanong um, nag-i-intraday ngayon. Because it's really hard to do intraday if the market is bearish. I tell you, the best, uh, if you want to go intraday, I'd, I recommend you go to Forex or um, international market when it's bullish. Mamaya na tayo. That's what I have always, always taught you, right, Gilbert? Um, be aggressive at the right time. Right now, it's not the best time to aggressive to be aggressive. Um, it's really hard to do intradays uh, during this kind of market. Kasi t- chances are the stocks, uh, walang na anong investor pag bearish yung market. So it's really hard to do intraday. But if you wanna intraday talaga, um, uh, Intraday, the best intraday strategy is sa scalping. So, kung gusto mo mag-scalping, look for trending stocks. Anong nag-trending for today? Um, look at that stock and then whenever it pauses and makes a pullback intraday sa 1-minute chart niya, wait for the bounce and then itry mo yung bounce niya. Or, 
yung nakikita mong it's surging up, right? Um, at that at that point nakikita mo yung ticker um pa, it's going up like crazy. Pasukin mo ka agad and then just get out right away. 1%, 2% gains, you get out. That's scalping. So, pwede kang mag wait ng pullback sa intraday chart and then let it bounce. Mga 1 to 2%, it's already okay. You get out and then look for another stock that will be trending. So that's but that's kind of hard right now in PSE. Noon nung bullish market ang ganda mas scalping but right now really hard. So that's why I've been telling you magposition lang muna kayo. Um Gilbert, um good that you're practicing. It's that just it's just that. It's not the right uh avenue to um practice. Go to eToro, create an account, virtual account and then yung 100,000 mo, i-practice mo. Si sila ano, sila um what do you call this? Sila Bitcoin. Maganda ang galaw ngayon. So, pwede uh, bit mga cryptocurrency, pwede mong i-try scalping doon. Right? Test that out. And insights pa rin po kay Vita, MRSG, I, and ABS. Still good to enter. Right? Si Vita, MRSG, I, and ABS. Still good to enter. Si ABS, yes, still good to enter. Was looking at it. Hindi ko lang dinagdag kasi medyo nakaangat now before we, uh, after we recommend it eh. So, medyo mataas-taas na yung risk. Marco Barin. Good morning, Sir uh, Coach Lloyd. Can you please recommend a trading school? Is Kalum any good Worth it? Um, hirap eh. I don't want to talk about I don't want to speak about it. It's just that ang akin lang is it's too expensive for my for my taste. Uh, that's just just my personal taste. No, I was looking at it, but nah, not, that's too much. I'd just rather uh, I'd just rather um, uh, invest the money. Ayan po. Marami pong magtuturo dyan na um, halos libre and others are napakamura oh nga pala um, if you notice um, wala pa ako mga trading courses right now um, I'm planning to make the trading courses into a video course para mas mura po uh, gagawin ko po mas mura if you really wanna learn how to study right so Marco Barin um, I do not uh, I, for me it's too expensive right um, right now with the information technology um I it's really easy to get education, right? So, in po um soon 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 um I'm going to make the video um available for everyone and I want to make it as cheap as possible para naman po ano um para naman po um hindi kayo uh, mahirapan when it comes to learning the stock market talaga. And I want to I'm very proud of this student of mine. Let me just um let me just uh open something. Give me one moment. Right, so, um, I wanna pick this, uh, I wanna shout out about this, ito yung sinasabi ko kaninang uh, a tournament, um, let me just, right, so if you go to this link, let me just open, um, let me just, um, copy the link, and then put it on the chat room, and then I'm gonna put it down on the video description also, and po, just go to that link, and you will be able to join this eToro Real Trading Competition, this is our Southeast Asia. Right? This happens every month. And I want to tell you guys, fifteen up to $15,000 every month po ang binibigay ni Itoro for the winners. Right? So first place, makikita niyo po dyan, 5K, uh, 2000, uh, 3000 for the second place. And third place, 2000 The rest is 1000 and 500 4 and 6, 1500 I'm very proud of this because um, for the month of May, um, hindi na po tayo makaka-join. Um, China, uh, yun. Uh, so we have Filipinos. Si newbie is on the second place. That's very good. But I'm very proud of April. Student ko po ito si Son Juja, and he won five thousand dollars. <laughs> po. So he's me. Uh, first he little story about John. Uh, I mean Son Juja. Um, he started with just copying me and he was a student of mine. Nagcopy trade lang siya sa akin and then he had the guts to really try out um what they call this try out the system that I taught him. Uh in the competition <laughs> and 
he was able to uh, for just one month 75% ang gains niya right uh, very risky trading this is intraday trading that's why there uh, if you want if you notice their risk score is very high because you have to be very aggressive so sadly hindi sila pwedeng kopyahin if your risks are this high but mas ma, uh, high risk high reward po ang plays nila because they're doing intraday trading if you're doing day trading it's gonna, it's gonna make your um risk score rocket up and if you are very ri a risky player um itoro doesn't want people to copy you because um though you're earning but you're very risky itoro really wants to make sure that people are safely earning as much as possible right but then again so juja congratulations i'm very proud of you uh he won 5000 uh for for june pwede pa po kayo mag join Right for me, meron tayong Pinoy na um nasa second place. Hopefully, maging Pinoy na naman for this year si newbie. Right is how at 140 um percent pero ito siya um in check in check yung nakasulat eh. So nasa 201 so medyo mataas pa. Um ang habol niya. But then again, two second place is $3000 if he'll, he will be able to maintain that. That's still a lot for a price sa competition it, it happens every month po so june if you want to join in june go to the link and you have to real uh, trade real money para po maka join kayo right so and po um join now so that you can sign up for june this is trading etoro account using real money so titingnan um the uh, you will have to uh, it will have parameters you will have to make your uh, account on public makikita yung um, performance mo so that you can join this uh, ano this uh, this competition mas matindi ito kasi matotoong pera ito na competition but then again the money is also very big half a uh, quarter of a million ang premium that's a lot so hopefully until december pa ito guys so if you're ready to join this join this all right and we will be having also at the same time si Itoro gagawan gagawan nila tayo ng financial freedom 101 cup Right, so all those um, eToro accounts under my uh, registration link, we will have a separate competition. We, I will have a separate program for you guys. So everyone who joined that, I will be teaching you, and then meron din premio, syempre. So excited about? I'm really excited about it. We're just ironing it out. So abangan yun po yan. Right, so congratulations again, kay Sonjuja. And so ayan po um. Let me uh, uh, let me go back <laughs> sa ano napariwara tayo but I really I'm I'm really happy for the for the outcome of this ano for the outcome of this um competition um uh Noel Minano sa insta.org hanggang kailan po ang yung standard waiting time before reservation will be canceled uh while well, still not be funded so five working days po for mangisda.org uh, after this uh live we will start to answer queries again so over the weekend i tried my best to answer people pero weekend po yon so walang office so medyo may hirapan kami pag pagsagot mark benson ong ism si ism hirap uh, ang hirap tantsahin ngayon kasi it's on a bullish run so i really can't say pwede bang pasukin ngayon for traders but uh investors We'll still will say wait for the pullback. Uh, antayin lang natin yung pullback as much as possible. George uh, Luzon, good morning, Sir Lloyd from Malaysia. Good morning sa inyo dyan. Julius Calero, good morning, Sir Lloyd. O nga pala from Malaysia. Meron ni Itoro dyan. Kasama sila sa competition na ito nakikita ninyo. Right? Not just Philippines, but even in, uh, even in uh, what do you call this, um, Malaysia, China, Hong Kong, lahat ng mga, excuse me, <coughs> yan, excuse me. <laughs> um yan lahat ng mga nasa Southeast Asia countries, countries. Yan. So we they were beat by a Pinoy. So um Pinoy number 1. <laughs> so congratulations. So, gusto niyo mag-join, please I invite you to join. Yun, yun wala naman mawawala sa inyo. If you're day trading, international market and there here. So kahit pa $500 lang yung port niyo, Sonjuja only traded $500 and percentage naman yung titignan. So, so $500 niya, he was able to gain how much? Um, More than 100%, uh, almost 100% percent Um, Let me open April again. Forgot. Um, so, Juja, 75%. So, almost $1,000 yung pera niya. And then, <laughs> 
$5,000 for this guy. So amazing. Quarter of a million for just $25 na ano. Why not, di ba? Try nyo po, mag-register po kayo dito. Right, Julius Galero, um, good morning. MPI and AEV. MPI is in my list. AEV, um, nagdadalong isip ako sir, since we're working on a downtrend. So, pwede na natin testingin siya. And then, if it goes further down, just keep buying it kasi mura na po yan sa AEV. It should go up anytime soon. Um, no, not anytime soon. In the future. Yan po, yung sakton term. Right. Bongkoy Mill, um, her, this is Hernan. Hi, Coach. SSI, please. SSI. Let's check it out. So, guys, um, load up your uh, load up your ano, eToro account. Pwede nyo testing si Bitcoin, which is on the, on a bull run. Um, you can trade Bitcoin in eToro. I just, I was just, uh, I was just trading it uh, yesterday. So, nag-gain ka agad. Jolly Garas, good morning, Sir Lloyd. And Laika, good morning then. Um, Amil Angelo, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Good morning, morning everyone. This will be a good day for PSE. Hopefully, yes, kasi nag-bounce na si PSE. Noel Manano, if mag-deposit ng cash value na more than the value of three reserve slots, namang yung Slada Torque, I can still reinvest it and see there's new wave 4 po. Yes, that is correct. Um, Mangista.org. Um, let me open the site really quick. Uh, just for everyone. Um, Nag-launch na po kami na Mangista.org last, what they call this, uh, last um, Saturday. Right? We officially launched it. So, congratulations. It was, it was a su successful event. So, last wave lang po i-open namin for the pilot projects. We really don't want it to be very big because we don't want to start big and maybe baka hindi makayanan because of the changes. We're gonna be in introducing corporate style employment and implementation in Mindanao kasi wala pong uso ang employment doon. Ang uso doon is pakiyawan ka lang. So, eh, ganito lang sweldo mo, ganyan, ganyan. So, we're gonna be applying um, corporate style uh, management for the fishermen there and the uh, caretakers and in po. Um, we, uh, there's gonna be a big change there, so we want really want to start small and, uh, yun, four four waves is gonna be manageable. So the question ni Noel Minano is if mag deposit na kasma. Ganit po po yan. for register um for reservation kasi kung wala kang pera, we only allow three reservations because people might spam it, right? If it's unlimited reservation ng account ninyo, what if someone um register uh, re, uh what they call this um reserves 20 units that's hindi naman itutuloy so it it is gonna hamper those who really want to invest diba? so we're only allowing three and then that reservation is good for three to five banking days kung hindi nyo po mapadala ang pera we're gonna be canceling that registration and then and making it available for the next people diba? now um for the question if magdala magpadala ka ng pera in advance in instead um if meron ka kasi pera dito sa account, that means you will not have limited reservations or investments because as long as your ba balance can, uh, can, what do you call this, can accommodate the investment, then it will go through. So, wala pong limitation if unahin niyo po ang pera. So, Wave 4 is already open. Um, after one week, um, we are very thankful for your support, guys. We were able to fill at least man, uh, kahit man reservation pa yung iba, but majority of the units are already uh, paid. So, Wave 3, medyo marami reservation because this was over the weekend. And in just one weekend, um, napuno Wave 3, we're opening Wave 4. And, um, Target date of the project to start is June 18, but as soon as ma puno na kaagad ang wave 4, we will start the earliest we can, right? Para wag naman po matulog yung pera na mas mahaba, right? So, um, that's for Noel, guys. Um, check out mangista.org. Go to www.mangista.org. Um, and create an account and then if you want to help, uh, check out our, um, cost first. If you go to www.mingisla.org and po, um, check out our cost video and you'll see uh, you'll see how good the project is and check it out and then after that we're going to be closing the investments for the first six months while uh, until the first harvest and po, um, we're going to be it's a very big change kasi ang mangyayari dito um, we're going to be making the project public na Every week, meron pong updates andun po sa page, Facebook page ng ano, at least, uh, ng mangista.org para at least you're updated so on your investments. Janeth, DG Emos, shift back to crypto since last two weeks, BTC, ETH, use, use Binance, uh, Coins.ph, and Abra, but I still check our 
I still check our stocks. Very good. Right, so nag crypto ako, um, pumasok ako yung XRPs and um Right, so medyo bumaba na naman um view chart um nag pull back si crypto, si XRP, sayang ang laki na ng gains natin kanina. But anyways, it's I think still it's going to be doing well. Um, yun yung problema kay crypto it's really trading real time so hindi mo baka hindi mo mabantayan Kaya just an hour ago $20 na po ang gains natin dito it's now back to $6 na lang <laughs> so ayan po tignan lang natin may buntag Pilipinas good morning then good morning sir from Asylum Boys ayan mga Asylum Boys good morning sa inyo dyan um, good morning sir Lloyd VUL po your thoughts um, I'll write down VUL Vulcan Diorico Docena, good morning Sir Lloyd, verified na account ko, that's good uh, We'll be verifying more accounts today um, after the daily grind kasi ako po magtatrabaho niyan John Kalimpong, Coach, good morning MRC, pag may, as may pag-asa pa ba? Of course there is, uh, MRC is uh, a company that's doing well It's just that the Philippine stock market overall is down Yet Kahit po napaka mga ang gagandang mga companies nagbabagsakan, di ba? MPI ka bumagsak, MRC pa kaya, so Yan po. Um, good. Uh, Josefina Etang. Good morning, Sir Lloyd. Watching from Taiwan. Good morning po sa inyo dyan, Josefina. Monet Lagman. Good morning, Sir. Happy Monday. Insights for BPI. BPI is so my recommendation today, right? EW also. I'm looking at EW. May, may, may magandang signal si EW. AC also. Yes. Um, 800 na si AC and there's a bounce. So, yes, this is okay for AC. Pwede na mag-start ng bodega. I just can't recommend it kasi we're going on a, against a downturn. Baka hindi marunong mag-handle yung mga, uh, what do you call this, mga newbies. Joanne Masipag, ganda ng pangalan mo ah, Masipag. Good morning Sir Lloyd, good morning then Richard New. Ma morning Coach Lloyd, good morning then. Oops, Buma bumaba bigla. Joy P, wow, good to hear that sir, can't wait. Abangan ko yan Sir Lloyd, Financial Freedom Cup. Yes, uh, your Financial Freedom Cup. Good morning Sir Lloyd, MPI please. Uh, yes, MPI is in my recommendations for today. I guess it's time to really bodega. Ngayon ko lang sinulat talaga si MPI. Para, kasi I think it's good to go na. Uh, we'll check out the charts later. Uh, Jeneline Ngo, good morning sir. SMC please. I'll write down SMC. Alright, Yoni Pioca, good morning sir Lloyd. SMC. And oh, nga pala guys, um, little story I wanna plug about this. Um, Mangisda.org. Um, Ang ganda kasi ng storya ng programmer nito ay 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 um this is um the website and they were able to do the database um ang programmer ko po dito is Mark 1 the group called Mark 1 let me just get their Facebook page for you um if you if you if you want to have someone create your website check out this guy i want to i really want to spend ar around 2 minutes to tell our story about this okay so um let me just get the link all right so here's the uh here's the page um i'll put it and put this in the chat room and po, if you are looking for a programmer check that guy out i'll also place his uh link under the uh, under the video description po. All right so this guy and po, smart one ph um this guy is a follower of mine so i was doing this live and then one day uh, someone messaged me sa Facebook page ko. He said, Sir Lloyd, pwede mo bang palitan ang kulay ng um, mouse cursor mo? So, if you notice now, ang mouse cursor ko is pula, <laughs> right? So, I asked, I was curious why. So, um, I, I asked him, bakit, bakit kailangan gusto mo palitan? Hindi ba nakikita? Uh, kasi, Sir Lloyd, handicap po ako, right? So, he is half blind. Ta sa yung tinatawag natin half. Um, He's, he has a very blurry vision to see charts, to look at charts. He has to zoom his uh, monitor 900 times to 1,000 times para lang po makita niya yung candlesticks. So even this guy is doing his best to really trade. So I was curious and talked to him. Ano ba profession mo? Right? Um, then he told me he is a programmer. Right? What hap and I asked him, what happened to your eyesight? And so he said, and he is a brain tumor survivor right his brain tumor was three forty uh one fourth his brain size right so um naka operation po siya and sadly his optic nerves were damaged because of the size of the ano, of the tumor na stretch po yung optic nerves niya so he can't see clearly now 
And then, I asked him, paano ka nakakapag-program pa ganyan? So, he has his methods. Grabe po, he doesn't give up. Ang hirap kaya mag-program, hindi mo makikita ang screen mo, monitor mo. So, it was really, it's really hard for him to do that. But, this guy, I tell you, never gives up, right? Um, so, I gave him this project. Let's see what you can do. Ayan. And binigay ko siya. This, is, this, was, this was a very big uh, challenge for him, right? Kasi mahirap itong website na yung mangista.org. Um, this is like a brokerage web- website, di ba? Na nakayanan niya. So, um, yeah. So, check this guy out, right, guys? If you're looking for people. Kung simple lang naman muna ang website ninyo and you think um, uh, people, uh, average um, programmers can do it, Bigyan niyo lang po dito sa kanya. Check out his uh, check out his page and just communicate with him. Right po. Kaya niya naman po ang mga mahirap na website as as uh, as evidenced here. He was able to do mangista.org and this is not an easy website, I tell you. And his 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 team was able, his, he heads the team and he's he was able to do it. So check this guy out um para tulong na rin po sa kanya. Right? If you're planning to make a website, um send a message to this guy. Grabe and fighting spirit. Very inspiring story. Okay, so that's Mark, right? So Mark ang pangalan niya. So send a message for him. Uh, 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 send a message to him so that um, if you have any websites you want done, right? This guy is gonna help you out. Right, so um, I'm gonna go to my recommendations for the meantime. And po, mag- um, punta muna ako sa recommendations saglit, really quick. Um, and distracted tuloy ako sa Ripple. <laughs> si Ripple bumababa na so na negative na yung earnings natin but that's okay. I think this is still good. Right. So okay pa. <laughs> and so um go let's go to the charts PSEI and um PSEI is now at 7583 7583. Uh that's good, very good bounce and it's an engulfing pattern so most probably mag-recover ang market. Ito, uh, international market has recovered already. So, hopefully, mag-follow ang sa atin. And this is very good sign. Good price action for PSEI. So, I think mag-recovery tayo. We're gonna be bouncing. Let's see what, what until where the bounce is to know for sure. Right. So, first, recom- uh, here are my recommendations again. I'll post it on the comments. And IRC. Nahin natin si IRC. Let me go full screen. IRC and IRC po um we are playing at the support levels for IRC so I'd say yes testing ni po sa IRC while well, nasa support pa uh, Mayor Abi is uh, one so that should be beneficial for the project ni IRC na inaabangan ng karamihan so yes IRC is there already and medyo tahimik na siya so that's good for a stock if tahimik na siya it's time to get in MPI so MPI naman we are at support levels already and we're seeing divergence already on the position so yeah um, I will recommend um, magbudega na kay MPI we're starting to see a reversal pattern very good price action right here reversal signals I mean hindi po reversal pattern so price action yeah we just saw the we just saw the bounce and then stabilized here and then starting to go up. So that should be a good sign There's uh, that there's a sign of reversal already. So hopefully, umakyat po yan, pero we have already a stabilization right there. Time to bodega MPI for good company. This is already very cheap. RCB. Next is RCB after MA20 bounce. Um, after triggering the upper Bollinger Band, may we have an MA20 bounce and okay pa rin. Um, earnings ni RCB are very good. 15% for first quarter. Last year, positive naman siya. So, price action wise, MA20 bounce. Use the MA20 as your support. This is already on an uptrend, right? The, the trend is your friend. This stock is on an uptrend. Higher highs and higher lows. So, mas malaki pong chances na manalo tayo dito and we have a support right here. So, get in here that support for RCB. Next is Mer. Alright, Mer naman. Um, we have a double bottom for Mer. And we have a bounce already on that bottom. I'd say yes, this is a good entry point for Mer. Alright, pwede na po natin testingin yan si Mer. Alright, maganda naman ang first quarter niya, 7% against. Uh, annual earnings is 12.7%. So that should help Mer to go up. Just in case we are wrong, because this is somehow... 
uh, yung ano niya, yung RSI niya, wala naman sinasabi na bullish na siya or anything. Uh, but uh, the support wa- support wise um, if you just use support and resistance this is already a good uh, area for mer to bounce and we have good volume um, we have healthy volume on that bounce so yes i guess mer is already okay just in case mali just cut loss okay kasi hindi natin alam saan pupulutin yan next right idc right idc we are Playing at the support levels ulit. Uh, so, this is cheap again for IDC. Very good earnings. So, um, first quarter and uh, first quarter 119%. Annual 101%. Those are very significant numbers. And yan po. Nasa support area na po tayo. Testing na po natin si IDC. I'm recommending IDC now kasi it's low risk. Next is now. We have good price action kay now. Nag-higher low na si now. So, I guess we have seen the bottom of now. And this is now the best entry point for now. Pwede nyo na pong pasukin now, right now. <laughs> Biro lang. Yeah, yeah, I'm recommending now for today because we have a support right here. Napakaganda po na position niya. Actually, this is the nearest support if you really want to get in. Let me just, sorry. Let me just remove these things. Kasi ang dumi na. Alright, so here we have a higher low and this is our new support right here. So, If you enter here, napakalapit lang po na support natin. So, now, I'm recommending now for today for trading. Na, well, nasa baba po yan. Right? CHIB, huwag po natin i-trade kung nasa taas na. Right? And then, sa baba, dyan natin simulan ng pagpas- magpasok. Budegin na po yun kasi napakamura na nun. CHIB, right? So, si China Bank, I'm recommending it for today. We are at support levels again and still very low risk. Maganda naman first quarter performance at China Bank. So, that should help it go up. And annual earnings is positive naman siya last year. And with the developments ngayon sa banks, which is good, I I would say yes, bude ka na kayo ng China Bank. That's already very cheap. And then lastly, si BPI also. Same position. BPI, we are at support levels. If you want to be conservative, wait for a green um, today before you want to get in. But BPI is still very cheap. Massive support at that level. Right? So, pwede nyo na po testing in yan si BPI. Right? These are the spots that where you should go in. Right? Um... Before uh um before we continue, we want to thank our sponsors, Tutid Asia. If you're looking for a broker here in the Philippines that's fast and reliable, Tutid Asia po, meron po silang mobile app so you can trade on the go. Even if you're outside, if you want to sell your stocks, you can. Okay? So, yan po, um, to trade Asia. And also, international market, eToro, if you there's a way to earn in uh, international stock market passively, you can always copy trade people you can copy copy me if you want to pwede niyo pong kopyahin ang ibang tao na mas magaling pa sa akin if you think they're better than me go ahead copy them at least you're earning passively in the international market napakaganda po ng international market ang laking pera po dumadaloy noon doon so create an eToro account marami pong developments ang eToro especially here in the Philippines soon we're gonna have a um Uh, trading cup financial freedom 101 cup um but just make sure you create an account under my link so if in ever hindi nyo po na create ang account under me please email this guy jeff gu at etoro.com and lagay ko po sa chat natin check that out um Yes, Ituro will be in Manila this coming coming Saturday. Yes, meron pong trading fair jan sa ano sa sa uh, sa Manila. So check it out, right? Um, to join that cup, um, you have to create an account under my li- um uh Ituro link. Uh, my Ituro link is down at the video description po. Anjan po sa video description. Make sure you create an account under me. If ever hindi nyo po nagawa under my account, um, please email Jeff Good to have him check. And then, if ever hindi po under sa akin, have him transfer it under me para po uh, maka-join kayo sa cup. Right? And in even in the Southeast Asia Cup, you can join. So, pwede niyo po isabay. Join the Southeast Asia Cup, uh, Itoro Trading Cup, and the Financial Freedom 101 Cup at the same time. So, pwede po yun. ba? Diba? Why not? What if manalo kayo? Di nanalo kayo sa dalawa. Okay, so... Um, let's go to our... Ano? Um, let's go to our... Um, Request ABBA and may nagtatanong about ABBA. Uh, so far, um, it's been breaking MA20, so medyo mahirap po si ABBA. Um, ang signals ni ABBA, we're, we're seeing lower highs, right? So it's really hard to say if 
ABBA is good to enter now, um, I will need more uh, data whenever I see, if I see a breakout from this flag, uh, this triangle pattern, that would be the best entry point. But for now, wag lang po muna, right? Because it's showing us downtrend signals. Uh, it's a bearish uh, pattern right here. This is a descending triangle. So, ingat lang muna kay ABBA. I'll, I'll let you know if may, may makita tayo na, ano, na buy signal for ABBA. But for now, wala pa po. SMC, and si SMC, yun din, nag-break ng MA20. So, kind of a hard signal for SMC. Baka bumalik sa support yan. Let's see for further movements in the future kasi medyo volatile pa si SMC. So, konti ingat lang muna. I will not be recommending SMC for today. SMPH, si SMPH, ito maganda. So, we have a confirmation right here. Yeah, we uh, we have a confirmation of support right here. We can we can already get in if you want to. Best if you can get in near the support as much as possible. But um, for investors, this is a good signal. Uh, traders, just wait for it to do a pullback and bounce at a higher low but before nyo pasukin. Kasi medyo mataas na yung bounce na SMPH. But these are good signals for SMPH. GMA7. One moment, please. Alright, so congrats sa mga pumasok eh. GMA7, we were talking about this, the support that the GMA was working on. I even told you na pwede na itong pasukin. So, gumaakit na siya. Let's wait for the pullback and bounce before you wanna get in. Use the MA20 as your support. Kasi mataas na yan. Very good volume. So, yes, this stock will be on an uptrend. Hanap lang kayo ng entry point. There's no entry point. GMA is giving us as of the moment. So, ingat lang. Meg naman. Ito si Mega World. Um... Ano eh, um, I'm seeing this signal. So, um, I think this is okay for Mega World already. Nagbe-break na siya sa MA20. So, um, it's just that you want to get in near the support as much as you can. Let it pull back and then bounce at support as much as possible. Or maybe pull back and make a higher low. At least doon nyo po pasukin for Meg. Okay? Um, kasi yung risk nyo for Meg, medyo mataas nito. I checked this earlier. The current price from the support, the nearest support is 3.7 already. Um, so, if you cut loss below that, so that's already around 7% um, risk for MEG. So, kind of high risk already. The reward is not worth it if you, if you want to chase it now. And then po yung resistance. So, I can't recommend it yet. MEG and WEB. Ito si WEB recommended the past uh, week and then nagpo pull back na siya. That's good. Let it pull back and bounce. A higher low will be a good entry point for WEB. So, congratulations sa mga pumasok kay Web nung ni-recommend ko yan. Right now, um, this is a challenge for those sa mga hindi nag-bodega sa baba. Um, you have to. You have to um, look for a new entry. Hopefully, it gives us a new entry. If wala, hindi po natin pipilitin yan. Ganyan lang sa trading. If it doesn't give us a new entry point, then don't force it. Vita. Si Vita naman. Let it, let's let Vita ch uh, chart. Yan. So, we have a resistance right here. This is an ascending triangle on the breakout. Inaabangan ko po yung si Vita. Kung mag-breakout man yan, testing natin. And then, at least we have a support if that breaks out before we want to get in. MRSGI. MRSGI. So, Metro Retail Stores Group. Same. Um, we're still seeing a downtrend signal. So, konti ingat lang muna. Though, we have a divergence here. This could be good for MRSGI. Yeah, I will I will recommend you test MRSGI. At least, nandiyan tayo sa support. Right? Test it out. Baka umakit si MRSGI. If not, just cut losses. Um, so far, nasa, nasa healthy RSI na rin siya. Maganda na yung RSI niya. So, pwede na natin i-testing. Yan si MRSGI. ABS. Yan si ABS, CBN. Um, already recommended it uh, at the support. Um, I think pwede pa. Let's check out our risk if we still get into ABS, CBN. I think pwede pa ito. Yeah, pwede pa ito si ABS, CBN. Very low risk still. So, I'm still recommending ABS. Ang ganda pa rin ang position niya. Habang nasa baba pa yan, pasukin nyo na. Testingan nyo na. Test, test buys lang. Um, wag nyo ano, all-in, pero wag nyo umakit na. Doon nyo pa ito testing. Magsisisi na kayo. Diba? So, if you wanna get in uh, ABS, I'd recommend it there. ISM, ang hirap na. This is what I'm talking about. Um, I've been talking about uh, buying ISM. Here's a dip. Here's another dip right here. Um, Kasi hindi natin alam kailan tayo bibigyan sunod ng buy position. And right now, it's not giving us any good buy position. Right right now, it's even giving us a slow... Uh, this is 
a questionable position kasi it could go up and break out or it could go down to MA20. So, it's really hard right now sa ISM. So, as much as possible sana doon sa baba. Right now, I cannot recommend it for uh, for buying. Uh, um, it's forming a flag pattern. So, bo- um, if you really want to enter this, just wait for the breakout because that's a confirmation na uh, get, nag-bullish na naman si ISM. So, right now, wag muna. Wag muna. Be patient. AEV. And AEV gave us, I am seeing this signal kay AEV. Um, did, I even wrote down AEV sana today for my ano, for my recommendation. But I don't want you to be greedy and be aggressive. We're still working on a downtrend, against a downtrend. So we'll wait for AEV to really break out or make a higher low before we want to recommend AEV. But so far, so good. Maganda na ano niya. Umabot na siya sa usual na RSI. But I... Turn, um, pulled down my ISI down to 20 para mas maganda ang signal. Speaking of this, uh, si Jollibee, pwede na kayo mag-bodega. JFC is now at 7277. Alright, but RSI, look at RSI. Malapit na po mahinog yan. Pag nag-green yan, pwede na kayo mag-umpisa ulit mag-bodega kay JFC. If it goes further down, just buy more. Alright, JFC. Um, next is ISM AEV. SSI from Hernan Lim. Alright, SSI doing pullbacks right now. Um, medyo nahihirapan ni si SSI eh. Paakyat yung presyo but uh, uh, what do you call this? RSI is starting to go down already. So, this is a bearish pattern right here. So, I cannot recommend SSI as of yet. Maybe a bounce at MA20 just in case magtuloy-tuloy yung um, uptrend niya. Then, that will be a good position. So, congratulations sa mga pumasok kay SSI. Pera. Ang niyayaman nyo na ngayon. <laughs> VUL. Right? So, VUL naman. Tingnan ko lang, tingnan ko lang sa Ripple again, guys. Ha? So, kinakamusta ko ito lagi eh. Right? So, it's still okay. Vulcan. Um, wait for the bounce and it will confirm the support right here for Vulcan. Right? We have a support area. Support is not just a line. It's an area. So, this is the support area. So, if it goes green, yeah, that's a confirmation of, uh, of a bounce. But, uh, ito yung problema ko kay Vulcan eh, yung mga earnings niya so very big negatives baka bumags, bumulusok yan si Vulcan right so I don't wanna recommend Vulcan MRC may pag-asa pa daw po um, it's just broke it just broke support so if you're trading this this is a trading stock cut loss please please be responsible with your trading always cut your losses yun ang papansin niyo po sa inter sa if you're following me on my uh, what do you call this on my um, eToro account I am trading here the reason why I am, the reason why I am all, almost always green is because I always cut my losses, right? Uh, medyo pulatay sa kay May um, kasi pangit ang market talaga this May kasi ang hirap, uh, ang hirap tansyahin, right? We're negative 282 um, but even my idol, mga idol ko sila chokowin, um, kami po, halos lahat pulahan <laughs> for me this guy is very good he made 185 percent last year halos po lahat ng mga even yung isa si si yung sino nga ba yun? si Ad, adam ba yun? uh the guy i recommended to you guys also before uh, let me just get the, the let me just get the name this guy has been inv- invincible right halos lagi pong lagi pong ano yan uh, not aim trader um lagi pong positive yung guy na yun uh, can you can you comment the name again of that guy who was that <laughs> kalimutan yung pangalan niya eh. alright uh, was it in my was he in my watch list let me get my watch list Lloyd Thomas no not Thomas was that Thomas no not, that wasn't Thomas hindi ko na ano hindi ko nalagay sa watch list ko um, forgot that guy. Uh, Olivier. Yeah, and si Olivier. Thank you so much, uh, Cecil. Olivier. Right, this guy is amazing. Olivier Danville. And Daniel yung iniisip ko eh, si Danville. So, this guy is amazing. Um, for the past two years, even until now, green yan. <laughs> Nakita nyo how hard May is, right? So, please forgive me for my May performance, but it's not just me. <laughs> Alas lahat ng mga magagaling na traders pulahan po for May. It's really hard to trade in May in the international market because it became volatile and the volatility is not normal price action. The volatility came because of Trump's tweet. Kaya po, mahirap. <laughs> so, yan po. Um, so, um, 
eto this guy amazing for the first time ever hula si Olivier negative then so it 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 made me uh, calm because realize na hindi naman pala ako ang nahihirapan almost every every trader is nahihirapan sa May ng performance right so but still I'm still trying my best para makabawi ah negative din naman si XRP but anyways still okay yan um let's go back um Unahin ko lang muna itong mga na, na requests na na request na before I want to continue with the chats. Uh, ISMA, VSSI, VUL, MRC, BPI, si BPI po. Um, BPI is in my recommendations for today so that's good. EW, yes, I'd say pwede na itong bodegain si EW. Hindi ko lang ni-recommend today. Like, ay, load please. Ayan, so EW medyo mataas na kasi nag-wrap up. So really want for EW to make a pullback first and bounce before I want to recommend it. So good job for EW. This is something we want to check out. And ha- abang tayo ng position. At least mayroon tayong support. Um, AC. <coughs> Excuse me. Si AC naman ang ganda ng volume. I can't recommend it because still shaky for me. It's a mix uh it, it's a mixed signal right now. So I don't want to be aggressive on this one. Maybe if it continues high and then pull back, that will be the best entry point for me. But for those investors kay AC, this company has been doing well. You can always bodega, right? First quarter niya medyo mababa. Um last annual niya naman last year is good. So um pwede niyo na po i-bodega to, right? It's been the lowest it has been and ganda ng volume ng bounce for AC. Um next kay AC is SMC, right? We talked. I think we talked about SMC already. Yes, we already did. So I can go back now to the comments of everyone. Neil Harold Managa, think, um, congrats, coach, for successful launching of Mayusta.org. Thank you so much, po. Um, Jeffrey Sahagun, pa shout out. Napaka informative ng vlog mo. Thank you so much, Jeffrey. Let me just go back. To the last message that I was able to send. I think that was Darcy Salvador. Yeah, Darcy Salvador VUL po. Um, we talked about Vulcan already. Right. Jorico Dosena. Good morning, Sir Lloyd. Verified na account ko. Yes, John Kalimpong. Um, Coach, morning MRC. Ayun, nabasa ko na ito. From Taiwan, from Josefina Monet. Good morning, Joan Masipag. Yun, I remember the last name si Masipag. Nabasa ko na ito. Um, fast Francis Fahilan, abangan ko Sir Lloyd yung Financial Freedom Cup. Yes, abangan niyo po yan. We're working on it. Medyo busy lang sila ngayon kasi there is a trading fair in Manila this Saturday. Um, was supposed to be there. Um, kaso nga lang hindi nang materialize. Um, so, next year lang. I'm gonna see you in the trading, uh, that similar event. Hopefully next year, right? Uh, I'll do my best to join that event. Right. Jeneline Ngo, good morning sir. SMC please, SMC. Um... We talked about that already. Yoni Pioca, morning sir. SMC then, All right? VUL Sir Lloyd, any thoughts? Darcy, we talked about that. Idski, good morning, coach. Insights for kay DMCI. Let's check out DMCI. All right? So what I'm gonna be doing now is, hey, DMC lang yan. DMC. I'm gonna be um re- reading the comments and check the charts right away. So DMC, napakamura ni DMC ngayon because of this downtrend um too aggressive for me i don't want to recommend this bounce though maganda naman yung volume sa bounce niya maybe this is gonna stabilize right so it's very cheap as of the moment yeah maybe i would say yes pwede na itong simulan mag bodega but hopefully ito lang yung problema ko kay dmc eh. pangit ng first quarter earnings si annual it closed negative for the longest time na always positive siya grabe very positive yan sila si dmc the past few years and quarters ngayon lang siya nagne negative i really want to check bakit siya negative ngayon before i can recommend it too aggressive for me i don't want to recommend dmc yet i would say uh, we need more we need more price action for dmc before we can say pwede na siyang bilhin sir low sir lloyd from regal manta good morning sir jfc please uh jfc on the bounce pwede na yan napakaganda na ng rsi ni um ni J- jollibee jose tamundong good morning sir bloom pha popi si bloom Ganda ni Bloom pero medyo mataas na po siya ngayon. So let's wait for the pullback and bounce before we want to enter Bloom. PHA, si PHA naman, buy as long as that support holds. Alright, in pre-recommendation ko kay PHA, just keep buying the dips. Ang laki po ng pera ng company na yan ngayon. And the price right now of the company is still very cheap. Alright, napakamura pa po niyan. Um, 
compared to the money that it has right now, to, compared to its net worth right now. Jaime Villafor, isang wave, buzzer equivalent sa isang fish cage. Yes, that's correct. Isang wave is one fish cage. Right. So, Jeffrey Sahagun, morning, Sir Lloyd. Good morning then. Yoni Pioca, SSI, Sir. We talked about SSI already. Kier Abacado, Acabado. <laughs> Sorry, Acabado. Uh, Alco. Na nagka nagkabaliktad yung pagbasa ko. Liit kasi dito eh. Right. So, Acabado, ay Acabado. Alco. Ren, Alco is doing a pullback. Let's see where it will bounce before you wanna get in. Wala pa pong signals to buy si Alco. So, stay away lang muna. Um, PLC. Uh, yan, PLC. Right? We talked about PLC. The, the the gaming industry is gonna be going up. So, PLC is go- giving us good signs. Kaso nga lang, downtrend pa po ito. Would say, let it break out, pull back, and bounce before you wanna get in for a confirmation of a reversal for PLC. So, yan po. Um, Neil, Harold Managa, congrats coach for the successful launching of wings.org. Thank you so much, Jeffrey. Uh, we talked about, um, for shout out. So, hello, Jeffrey Sahagun. Gil Albuero, morning, Sir Lloyd, watching from Myanmar. Nag-register na po ako sa eToro last time, pero hindi ko po nagamit link nyo. Pwede pa ako sumami, sumalik sa competition kahit hindi ko po nagamit yung link. Please send an email to Jeff Gu and then have your um, your registration be under me. Right? Sabihin nyo po na si Sir Lloyd po ang nag Pwede po Tagalog kasi Pinoy po yan. Um, sabihin niyo po na uh, si Sir Lloyd po ang nag, uh, regi- uh, nag-recommend po sa inyo for me. Uh, referred me to create an eToro account. So please ha- uh, please put my name under his uh, referrals para po ma-under kay sa akin. Because the, the cup will only be open, the, yung Financial Freedom Cup will only be open to... Uh, accounts that are under me and while the cup is ongoing i'm gonna be teaching all the competi- competitors that's gonna be part of my exchange for you guys gagawa po tayo ng mga sessions to teach you so you can always join and then kahit hindi nyo po um habol ang manalo at least yung learnings lang right jeffrey sa agon ido almo sir lloyd good day po shout out lang po sa brad ko si brian Solier, future investor, Ed. Good morning, um, Ido, and you, to your brother, Brian Solier. Kaloy, 62. Good morning, Idol. Good morning then Neil, suggestion coach, mas okay siguro pag sasamayin nyo yung mga approved, then yung mga pending, sasama din, mabuo agad kada wave. Totoo po yan. Alright, we're, we're thinking about it. It's just that the programming behind that is gonna be um, not easy. So, at least we're still, uh, we're still okay. We're still early on. Ganyan po ang mangyari. We're gonna be consolidating everything to one cage and fin case. Hindi talaga mapuno. Right? Mas, mas Misaki Anime, good morning from Alabang. Medyo linakasan ko ang boses ko kasi umuulan. Hindi ko marinig sarili ko. <laughs> right? Um, good morning from Alabang Med Hospital. Thank you so much. Right? Thank you rin, Misaki. Good morning sa inyo dyan. Los Areco. Sir Lloyd, ano difference ng long and short? Nakakalito. Long position is Sim- to simply put it, if you are on a long position, if the stock goes up, you earn. But you have to buy the stock, right? If the short position naman, if the stock goes down, if you open a short position, right? If the stock goes down, then you earn. Ganun lang, right? But still, you have to have initial capital to do that. So, if you wanna, if you think the stock is gonna go up, buy a long position for $200. If it goes up, you earn. If it's uh uh if you think the stock is gonna go down, then uh click uh use a short position, put in two hundred dollars, and if the stock goes down, you're gonna earn. Uh, that's the simplest way to put short um short selling and long positions, right? Well, you know, maybe in the future you can uh you can go uh, you you can up to para malito kayo really wanna go deep into it. How how do you earn by just shorting the stock? But basically, that's the concept. If the stock goes down, then you're gonna earn. That's it. If it goes down 10%, then you earn the 10%. Armonde Rodriguez, thanks. You're welcome. Bert Loberta's Pizza, please. Let's ch- check out Pizza. Pizza. Ayan, si Pizza. Uy, kakabals lang ni Pizza. Alright, y- yun. Tinignan ko to kanina. The problem is, ito eh, sobrang taas naman ng bounce niya. So, if, would, if it would have been na dito lang yung green niya, we could regi- uh, we could recommend pizza, but now it's in between support and resistance, so I don't want to recommend 
pizza anymore. Maybe if it will pull back and bounce. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Sakit na nalamunan ko. Haven't, re- haven't recovered yet because I was talking the whole day last Saturday during the seminar. So, medyo masakit pa lalamunan ko. Tommy Montano Escobedo, Morning Coach, DNL, FGen, ATN, and GFC, DNL. Ay, hindi ko na nakamusta si DNL. Oh, yan. Nag-downturn pa si DNL. This is good, guys. Abangan niyo po si DNL. Marapit na naman siya sa level kung kailan ko nire-recommend si DNL. So, abangan po natin. DNL is a good company. First quarter, medyo mababa. But annual earnings still okay. So, malapit na naman ito mahinog. Pag mahinog ito, pasukin niyo po si DNL. Very good company to invest in. FGen. FGen, um, still on a downtrend. Let's see if, if FGen does a pullback and makes a higher low. Yeah, we can test it out. If ever gumawa ng high, higher low yan. Si ATN naman, I will recommend ATN for uh, for for long term naman. So, just just keep buying the dips for ATN. So, pag um, it's starting to really lose the, ano, lose the attention. I really like if a stock na, mawawala ng attention. Kasi makaka-stabilize siya at gagalaw. So, it's starting to lose attention already. ATN is starting to lose attention at this point. So, pag nawala na yung attention dyan, makakapag-stabilize na yan. It, it will go up. Same with ISM. Nung nawala na yung attention kay ISM, nakapag-akyat siya. Right? So, ATN. Ingat lang muna. Or, um, just keep buying the dips for ATN. Tommy Escobedo, salamat po. You're welcome. Si JFC, we already talked about it. Noel Minano, Sir Itoro, $500 starting. And per day of copy trading, you may cost po ba? Wala pong cost ang copy trading. Copy trading is for free. Nagkaka-fees lang yan. If ever I open a leveraged position, kasi ang leverage may bayad. Or if I open a short position, may bayad po yan. Kasi naka-short din kayo because you copied me. You get charges also. But for copy trading, there's no fees. And then, $500 starting, no. I just recommend you start with $500 kasi sayang yung opportunity, opportunity na merong tumutulong sa inyo mag-trade for copying. So, I recommend $500 to $1,000 to start. Um, if $200 lang kaya ninyo, you can already copy with just $200, right? Cecil Pange, uh, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Thoughts po kay Primex DMC. We talked about DMC already. So, Primex naman, PRMX. Right, so Primex, uy, Grabe yung pullback ni Primex. So, um, it's a divergence though. So, this is good for Primex. Pwede nyo po ito. Pwede nyo po i-testing si Primex. I think that's good for Primex. The position is good for Primex. At least very low risk. Testing nyo po yan. Right? Primex. Fet- Petix. RSDC. Good morning, sir. Alin po ang maganda? Binary or digital? Um, ano po ang ibig nyo sabihin? Binary or digital? Uh, Petix, can you please uh, post more about that? What do you mean by binary or digital? Ano yung binary at digital that you mean? Uh, John Johnson, CEB, buy back mode. CEB, kamustayin natin si CEB. Right, so CEB. So far, so good. May nag-upper Bollinger Band triggers sa CEB. So I guess this is good. I'm just wait for the pullback before you wanna get in. Antayin lang natin kasi paakit na naman si CEB. Okay, uh, Christian Gabriel Cote, Sir Lloyd, will a dip to 6.5k levels in BTC uh, still possible? As of the moment, I can't say. Um, I don't think it will because it, it already did a pullback. But anything is possible in stocks. Um, view chart. Alright, so, yan, umakit na naman. So, um... We can say. I don't think it's... Uh, let me see. BTC. BTC. And si Bitcoin. And 6.5. Uptrend pay. I don't think it's gonna reach 6.5. It almost did. That was the best entry point right there. Right? So, dapat napasok natin ito. It's just that I chose... I chose XRP better than... Uh, better than uh, Bitcoin. Kasi Bitcoin is napaka... Uh, napaka-unstable po ni Bitcoin or very volatile. Um, g- nagustuhan ko si XRP because it's the most adapted, one of the most adapted cryptocurrencies in the world, especially the banks, di ba? Um, I want you to read about this uh, article. I've been, uh, I've been, I've been, uh, I've been 
uh, talking to experts about XRP, Ripple XRP. Right? So, ang pinaka target po kasi ni XRP is um banks, right? I found the website, right? So here. So the banks are using XRP. Uh, one of the most adapted cryptocurrencies in the market is Ripple XRP designed to challenge Swift. If you've been sending money uh, all over uh, across abroad, yan, alam niyo po yung Swift. Ang laki po ng bayad niyan para makapagpadala ng pera. The primary purpose of Ripple is to facilitate secure, cheaper, and faster transactions between financial institutions. Kasi napakaliit lang po ng charges magpadala ng crypto right in 2019 Ripple as well kept on adding more financial institutions so mga banko po ang gumagamit na Ripple that's why si Ripple po ang gusto ko kasi mas stable and mas adapted just sa mga banks right and if you know for a fact last year if you ask Itoro ano po yung pinaka traded na ano na 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 asset right um, from stocks or commodities indices Si Ripple po ang pinakamalaking volume. So, that's why I prefer get, getting into Ripple instead of Bitcoin. Okay? So, so far, ayan, you can check this out if you want to. Right? <clears throat> if it goes to 6.5, I don't know. We don't really know. Um, we don't try to predict the market. We just react accordingly to what it does. Right? Noel Minano, sir, I was in that chat that day when Mark, the programmer, asked to change the cursor color. O nga pala, yes. O, Noel Minano, yes. That guy, guys. Again, um, Mark1, ayun, binigay ko sa link kanina, um, facebook.com slash Mark1 Philippines. Check him out if you want to, ano, if you want to create a website, this guy can help you. It's gonna be a big help for him also. This guy has a very inspiring story, I tell you. Right, Noel Minano, yan. Um, Melinda C. Tumat, Tumataas ko po kasi si BTC at the moment. Yes, it is. Uh, hi, Coach. Looking forward kung may advanced lesson ka in the future para makapag-enroll muli. April 6 to 7. Student here from Hernan Lim. So far, as of the moment, wala pa ako ginawa na new na course. Um, but yeah, Richard Sulaiman Olarte. Kasi yung tinuro ko actually is already been working. It's been working for me. It's just that you have to really uh, master it first. Right. Good morning, bro. BPI and PHA. Salamat from Richard. We already talked about that. Time check. It's 9.20. Bilis ng oras. Ha? Dexter Lopez, may buntag, Sir Lloyd. Pa-attendance po sa imong channel. Hehe. <laughs> right. Watching here from Doha, Qatar. Shout out sa mga traders in Qatar at Al Safa family. Right. Good morning po sa inyo. God bless. Paolo Drew Green po, Sir Lloyd. Checked out Green. Medyo tagilid si Green. Right. Um... Nag, ano siya, nag downturn siya, broke supports and then make this uh, made this ano um made, made this uh, what do you call this uh, new support now though pero mas mababa na but this is what I'm concerned about I haven't checked this out kasi eh. what caused this this is negative 9000% so that's a big drop I just want to see what caused that maybe meron sila expansion di ba di ba gumagawa ng mga power plants si eh? green baka yun yung dahilan but right now, I'm shaky because of that. I haven't checked out the fundamentals of green yet again. Argel Mendoza, good morning, Sir Lloyd and Laika. ISM po. Thanks, right? We talked about that already. Bert Lobertas, good morning po. Pizza. Uh, yeah, we talked about that already. Popey, sir. Si Popey, medyo mataas na po si Popey. Congratulations sa mga pumasok kay Popey. For those early na mga, uh, yung mga followers ko na noon pa, I kept telling them na um, bodega nyo lang si Popey. Napakamura pa po niyan. Right, so Poppy, uh, these were the levels we recommended it here, recommended it on May 20, and then there it is. Um, it's already very high right now. I don't like these kinds of breakouts because I don't like breakouts na anjan sa taas, but the volume is very good. Congratulations, naglabas na magandang earnings si Poppy pala kaya pala. So I wanted to pull back and then before you get an entry point, this is a missed opportunity. Rule, very important rule you need to follow in trading, never ever ever go after missed opportunities right this is a missed opportunity if you're trading it wait for it to pull back before you want to enter always wait for an entry point michael masagka watching from dubai good morning sa inyo dyan. sa dubai napakaaga pa sa dubai ngayon so grabe yung mga yan right um paul untayaw good morning sir lloyd pakitingin ng ism and the mwc let's check out mwc mwc right so Alright, MWC. 
Uy, eto, maganda. Um, it's starting to give us good price action. Let's see if MWC... Eh, pwede nyo po testing ito, MWC. Let's see if MWC gives us a good uh, a good support. Pero too aggressive for me. Uh, I'd say I will strongly recommend just waiting for it to stabilize, really make us much more stable support before you wanna get in. Baka kasi nagpahinga lang yan. Pangit na first quarter earnings ni MWC. Eh. Pero baka gumanda yan kasi... Um, Maganda na ang panahon. Alright. Itoro will be in Manila this coming Saturday. Melinda, yes, they will. Uh, you're, um, please say hi to them for me. <laughs> it, um, the people who are gonna be there is Jeff Gu and Paul Familiaran. So, uh, they are, ano, they are, uh, they are the uh, Philippine team for, ano, for, for Itoro. So, check them out. Um, yan po. Sabi niyo po, regards ako. Yan, mga pogi, yung mga yan. Tignan ninyo. Sa so, mga girls, mga followers, if you go there, itoro guys are looking well and Jeff is single. <laughs> Inadvertise ba si Jeff? <laughs> Sorry, Jeff. Pasensya na. We were talking about that. He's 23 and he's single. Pero pogi yung taong yan. If you wanna see how he looks like, <clears throat> not bad. Diba? Not bad. Um, little side beat lang. Katuwaan lang natin. Alright, so these are the itoro guys. Right, so this one is Paul Familiaran, the one in the middle, and this is Jeff. Right, in chick siya, pero pinoy puyan. Right, um, marunong magtagalog din yan. So, <laughs> yeah. So these are the Itoro guys. Expect them in Manila next, uh, next, uh, next week. And so going back, <clears throat> John Vincent Pleto, hi sir, recommended entry po kay JFC. I'd say just buy it on the bounce, any bounce you can see. Right, pwede nyo na pong pasukin niya kasi maganda RSI niya. I can't say it's the bottom. Ang gawin nyo lang po dyan is if it bounces, get in. If it goes further down, just buy more. Testingin nyo po. Be humble in your trading. If you, uh, please bear this in mind. I always teach this to my, ano, to my students. You cannot, hindi naman say you cannot. It's very hard to guess the bottom of a stock. Right? Kung hindi yan bottom, okay lang. The point is, if for these kinds of stocks, the mga gandang companies, if it you see a very good signal, it's already very cheap. Just buy it. If it goes cheaper, just keep buying it. If it's a good company, it should go up anytime soon. Hindi nyo po mahulaan ang bottom niyan, right? Swerte nyo na po if mahulaan niyo. So just keep buying it while it's down. So, um, John Vincent Pleto, hello sir. Recommended entry. We talked about that already. Misaki Anime. Um, M wide. M wide. Sa yung opportunity guys na nagmumura si JFC. If hindi nyo po pupapasukin yan, what if mag-bounce na yan at magtuloy-tuloy. So, ending, hindi kayo nakapasok. ba diba? MWC, uh, M-Wide, um, um, very shaky, very volatile position right now. I don't want to recommend it yet. Medyo nasa taas po siya kasi. Um, last two lang po, it's already 9.25. XMR, um, dito lang muna tayo. Let's concentrate on PSA for now. Ben Mua, may buntag Sir Lloyd. Happy viewing here in Taiwan from Cebu. Wow, good morning, Jan. Happy Monday sa lahat. Sir JFC po from Russell. Giovan PLC po. Si PLC, we, nadaanan ba natin si PLC? Yes, I think we did. Right, si PLC, um, wait for it to do a breakout. Um, Karen Ong, good morning, sir. Tech, eto si Tech, eto maganda. Right, si Tech, I've been looking at Tech. Um, just waiting for Tech to do a pullback before it wanna, you wanna get in. So, I've been talking about Tech, very good company. At ayun na miss natin yung bottom niya so that's the problem with not getting in right away so we missed the bottom and nag um, reversal signals na siya so let's wait for it to pull back and make a higher low before we wanna enter tech right so that's it na lang muna um, <laughs> so Lilita sabi niya true sir pogi si Jeff bait pa kausap pag may queries just like you <laughs> mga papa ayan avid fan here ayan so Ngayon ko lang napansin, polo shirt tayo ngayon, sir. Ah, nasanay ako, plain t-shirt. <laughs> Naka-polo shirt ako ngayon. Right, so that's it for today. I'll see you again tomorrow. I think it's gonna be a good day for P, uh, PSE. So, hanap na kayo ng mga bottoms, especially those who I, which I gave you. Let's get rich together. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, everyone.